Hey everyone, my name is Leslie and today I will be showing you my Mackenzie Child collection. Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, as you can see on the title, I will be showing you my entire Mackenzie Child collection. I have been wanting to film this video for so long, but I'm really excited that I finally got the chance to film it and what a perfect time because Mackenzie Child is having their barn sale from July 28th to August 1st. So it's only a couple of days to show you all of my Mackenzie pieces. And let me give you a little background on Mackenzie Child and I. <laughs> I have been loving Mackenzie Child for the longest. I did decorate for Halloween last year and I showed you guys a few pieces that were so pretty. Um, I think it was the pitcher and also um, the tea kettle, which I'll show you in just a second. In my previous kitchen, to be honest, I didn't like it. But now, this kitchen, honestly, I love it. <laughs> so, I feel like I can bring in more Mackenzie Child pieces into my home. And Mackenzie Child pieces bring me so much joy. Just looking at the pattern, the black and white, the checker. Something about them, it's very magical. And I use them all the time now. At first, I didn't want to use them because that's how I am. Like, with pretty stuff. I feel like I don't want to ruin them and then you know what I'm like I need to enjoy them because that is why I bought them and just cooking on my pods and everything or my pod <laughs> it's, it's just so nice it makes my everyday um, living a little nicer I don't know if you guys can understand but that's just how I feel all right I'm gonna start with this item right here this is a napkin holder really pretty and I believe I got this for like 30 bucks it was really affordable uh, compared to the other pieces that I'm gonna show you but this is one of my favorites I have it in my kitchen right next to my stove I also have this picture I have it in two sizes this is the small one and also the large so what I like using this pictures for pretty much I like doing arrangement like flower arrangements and also for dinner, I pour in water here and I bring it to our table so that we can all have dinner together. And there's like a thing that I have. I honestly don't like it when people get up when we're having dinner. So I make sure I have everything set up on my table so that we can all enjoy each other's company, chit chat, and just have a good time without having to get up. I try my best not to get up from the table. So. A picture like this, it was perfect. To be honest, I kind of want another one just to have two of the same size. Um, one by my husband and one by me so that we don't have to like get up. I'm telling you guys, I tried to make life a little bit more easier. <laughs> I also have this uh, resting spoon next to my stove. This is really nice. I love it. It was only like 20 or 30 bucks too. This was a little bit cheaper. So if you want to start your collection, um, if you do not want to spend a lot of money on Mackenzie Child uh, pieces or you just want to test it out, I suggest you start with something like this, something a little bit more affordable. Um, and it's just going to add a little touch of glam or magic into your kitchen. Whenever I think Mackenzie Child, I always think Alice in Wonderland. I'm not sure why, but I do. And I just think it's so pretty. I love, love the pattern, the black and white. And I noticed that they have a collection, from time to time I have seen this, where it's polka dots. I actually have one piece that is polka dot and stripes, and I'm going to show it to you right now. Well, in a little bit after this. This is my champagne bucket. Super duper nice. I love using this as a flower base. And I believe I also used it as a... Um, right next to my stove, I put all of like my tools for cooking and stuff. Um, yeah, but I haven't done that in a while. And also, the material of this uh, pieces is stainless steel. Super cool and it's easy to wash. Like super easy to wash. Alright you guys, my next item right here is this bowl. Unfortunately, I do not use this bowl because it came damaged. I have not had a chance to return it. Um, as you can see right here, there's a little um, part where uh, the paint came off so that made me really sad I do plan on returning it because it, it says it on the instructions if it peels off or it cracks like this you shouldn't be using it so 
I haven't even used it and it's pretty big. This is, I believe this is the medium and I also have the small. And here I like using this one right here for um, pizza toppings or what else do I use in here? Yeah, pretty much pizza toppings whenever we have pizza night at our house. Sometimes if I'm making breakfast, I'll crack a few eggs and then just like mix them around and then pour them on the pan. So this is what I use that for. And oh, by the way, my champagne bucket, I have never used it for champagne or drinks or nothing like that. Just for the flowers and my kitchen tools. I purchased, like I said, most of them on the barn sale except for three pieces. I have a pumpkin too that is gorgeous. I'm gonna bring it out for Halloween so you guys will see that. Um, be sure to follow me on Instagram. That's where I will be posting my Halloween decor. And hopefully I'll do a, a Halloween tour here too. But this is another Mackenzie Child piece. But this right here is glass. And I wasn't expecting it to be glass. So therefore I try not to use it much because I feel like it's gonna break. But you can open it up and have some candy. You can make the lines to be the same or twisted and it makes it a different pattern. I love the little swirling part on the top and this is one of my favorite, favorite pumpkins. And I actually got it out a few months ago um, to use it around the house and it was fine. I feel like I can get away with it even though it's a pumpkin. I'm not sure if their pumpkins are going to be on sale at the barn sale. I think they are, just a few. Last year I remember seeing the really teeny ones. Uh, I think my friend Eleni purchased a few. If you guys not follow Eleni, she's another Mackenzie Child lover. Um, she has a really nice collection. And also Julie Simply Love. That's my girl right there. <laughs> it's also Eleni. They're my sisters. <laughs> They're super nice. And they have a really nice collection. I know Julie's collection is pretty big. Her house is gorgeous. Um, if you guys don't follow her, she has an Instagram and also a YouTube channel. So check her out. I'll have a link up here. Or actually, I'll put my girls in the description box. Um, but yeah, they have a really nice collection. They should do a, a haul too. Hopefully, oh no, actually, they're really busy right now. They're moving. Uh, my friend Eleni is moving to Florida. And then Julie just bought a new house. So congrats, Julie. I'm so excited and I cannot wait to see your home. All right, I'm getting off topic. <laughs> um, I'm having so much fun filming, you guys. It's been a long time and I miss you all so much. So, yeah. <laughs> but anyways, my next item right here, this is the polka dot um, container. or I don't even know what you call this. I want to say it's like a candy holder. This is for Halloween. And as you can see, it has the stripes all around, kind of like an umbrella. Super cute. This is made out of glass, you guys. I cannot get it out because I feel like the kids are gonna break it. So I have it up there, like on my um, cabinets, like all the way at the top. But I love, I love, love, love the polka dots. If you know me, <laughs> you know I am a lover of polka dots or a polka dot lover. I believe I bought this in January. I can't remember, but this was, um, I was like, I think this was pretty pricey, so was this. But I wanted to have a few pieces here in my home for Halloween. I will link everything down below, you guys, so if you're interested, uh, check out the description box. Let me know if you're enjoying this video. And uh, if you're shopping to sell, what are you looking for this year? Or right, we're gonna talk about that after I show you this three items. Over here we have my most favorite pot in this house. <laughs> this is another Mackenzie Child piece. And as you can see on the top, this has a flower. The details are so nice. But right here, I most of the time make pasta for the kids. And I have made meat here. It's so pretty. I get so much joy whenever I am cooking in my pretty Mackenzie Child pots. Um, this year, for the sale, I do plan on purchasing, I want to get a, at least three pods because I know they're going to go on sale. I have an order coming in soon for Mackenzie Child. I'm not going to tell you what it is. You got to wait. It's really good. But yeah, you guys, I am a Mackenzie Child lover. And it's so funny because a few years ago, I was like, I just can't buy them. Like, 
I, I, I'll just wait until the kids get older. But then when I found out about the material, I was like, you know what? They're kids friendly. <laughs> as long as it's not glass, it's like perfect. But yeah, I love me. Some Mackenzie child. And then up next we have my two most favorite tea kettles. Here we have the small size with the little red um, accessory on the top, I guess you can say. It has flowers, it's really pretty. And then on this side we have the one with the little bird, you guys. This is my favorite. I use it all the time whenever I make noodles. If you follow me on Instagram, you know that I'm always cooking. <laughs> Every day I post a picture of what I make. And when I make my, my family noodle night, which is like Japanese noodles, I always use these pots and I don't know, you guys, they're just so pretty, very easy to clean. And I have used this for, um, what's it called? For flowers too. And my girl Julie was the one that gave me the idea because she displayed her um, flowers on the tea kettle and it looks so pretty. So I was like, you know what? I'm gonna do that too. <laughs> and so I did. I believe for this pod, it does retail for like 200 bucks. But during the sale, it goes down to like 150. So it's like a major discount. So I highly recommend you guys to shop the sale if you're planning on purchasing big items. And also little ones, to be honest. Um, because it is a really, really good sale. I don't remember how much was uh, this tea kettle, but I'll link it down below. I know this one right here was like 70 bucks, which is super, super, um, I don't want to say affordable, but it's a really good discount compared to the retail price. I cannot wait to score some pieces for this 2021 barn sale. Let me know in the comments down below. If you're shopping the sale, what are you looking for? Um, I want a few things. I'm going to try to just get whatever is best deal. I don't want to spend too much. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm really, really excited. I just, I love my Mackenzie Child pieces and I cannot wait to see my collection grow as the years go by. Don't forget the Mackenzie Child barn sale starts on July 28th all the way to August 1st. So if you want to save 30% off, be sure to shop on those days. Thank you so much for watching, you guys. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I will see you on my next one. Bye!